other day, I received a um, Twitter message from uh, actual Apple News. I have subscribed to their feed on Twitter. By the way, follow me at twitter.com slash masterASM. Uh, somebody emailed me about the, uh, the new iPod Shuffle, which is now available. I am almost positive it's now available. It's supposed to be twice as small, and um, I don't know. I'm just not sure. It says it's twice as small. It looks really, really clean and really nice. And the reason it looks really clean and really nice is because, guess what? The only thing it has on it is a clip. No buttons. Only an earphone jack. I think it actually has the on and off button, like the little switch. And, uh, hang on, let me let me see if I can, uh, let's just show you here. Hang on. Really quick. All right. Oh crap. Hang on. I'm sorry. This iPod. I'm uh, running two things at once and it gets a little slow, but. Yeah. Uh. Load, you freak. So here is the new iPod shuffle right there. One second. One second. I'm really sorry, guys. Keep watching, though. Um. the brightness down. So ridiculous. Alright, uh, there's the new iPod Shuffle. That's what it looks like. I don't know if you can see that or not. I will post a link in the description. And pretty much if you go on Apple right now, uh, it's it's there. That's, that, I mean, that's kind of their thing. Uh, that's their home screen at least. I don't know. I, I, I mean, I'm running my iPod Touch original version, first generation, whatever. You know, it's great, works fine. Got internet, email, all that crap. You know, I, I love it. Okay. Personally, if I wanted an iPod, uh, and I'm really, hang on, let me see if I can see how much this is here. I, I, I'm, I'm kind of unprepared for this, but oh well. Let's see how much it is. Okay, uh, small talk. Okay, and there it is. Let's just click on it. And, eh, it, it looks a little cheap to me. I mean, so small, you know, look, the smaller to pr pretty much to me looks like the more fragile. Uh, okay, iPod uh, 4 gigabyte, which that is a kind of an up for Apple. Most of their iPod shuffle lines have either been 1 gigabyte uh, and two gigabytes, but now they have four gigabytes. That's very nice. That'll hold about a thousand songs. Uh, iPod Shuffle four gig for seventy nine dollars. Would you pay that? Mm, nope, not me. I just go ahead and spend an extra seventy five bucks and either get the new iPod Nano Chromatic or save up another you know seventy five bucks and get the iPod Touch. You know. Uh, oh well, I don't really care. Uh, okay, let me tell you the cons and the earth actually the pros and the cons the pros would be number one it's small it's poor it's very very portable uh, number two it has a clip um, <clears throat> excuse me uh, number three um, don't even know if I'm gonna be able to come up with three but oh yeah it's four gigabytes so that's very nice it holds uh, at least a thousand songs that's that's another that's one now the cons and it's gonna be an everlasting list but the cons, number one, small but fragile. I've always heard that term, small but fragile. Uh, you know, most of my stuff is kind of big, so, yeah. Oh, well. <laughs> uh, nevertheless, they're still fragile. But, um, hang on, let me go back to my screen here. Okay. Uh, probably number two, the cons. Uh, the actual controls, and I showed you that it had no buttons whatsoever, and you may be wondering, how the heck is that possible? Well, the buttons are integrated. You got a pair of earphones, Tony? Right there behind you. Right there behind you on the desk. On the desk. Or on the top, right there. Yeah. The the buttons. Hang on, my earphones. Oh, gosh, these earphones are like a piece of crap. These get wound up. Okay. All right. So you're listening to your iPod. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. Here's how you control it. I think I think it's in the left or right. But it's got a little control button. Okay. It's retarded. Okay. The, it's got a, a center button and a up volume and down volume. It's it's the stupidest design I've ever heard of in my life. Okay, uh, the center button you hold and 
I think it like talks to you or something. Like if you want to go through playlists on iPod Touch, that's another pro, I guess. You can have playlists on iPod Touch or on iPod iPod Shuffle. Sorry if I say iPod Touch. I have one, so that's one. iPod Shuffle. Okay. Uh, <coughs> excuse me. Uh, probably another con is that if you want to use your own earphones, which I think is available, you have to buy a little little extender jack thing. That goes in there, I think it's about this long, about that long, but then it has a little volume control thing right there, and then you can plug in your earphones, which is still stupid. Uh, the, iPod shuffle, the last iPod Shuffle actually wasn't that bad. I don't really see why they had to upgrade to the new one. Pfft, whatever, who, who cares, not me. They always have to come out with new stuff and tick people off. Uh, but, not. I mean, it's not too bad. Uh, another con is probably seventy nine dollars. Would you really pay that for a four gig? I mean, you know, <laughs> any real person who wanted to listen to real music would not get an iPod Shuffle. I think mainly it has a little clip right there, and that's the only reason that I think if I was a jogger or worked out a lot, I'd probably. I mean, maybe I'd use that, but eh, okay. Uh, so that's about it with the iPod Touch. <clears throat> I will post a little annotation, which will be right about, I don't know, there for my new video. Uh, actually, it'll be like right there, that way, something like that. And that'll be for my new video I'm going to do on the uh, iPhone 3.0 software. So just check that video out. Uh, also, visit me at MasterSM.com. Put the link in the description. Peace out.